forward and three, two, one, sink. sink. Start recording. Bark, 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 bark. I'm gonna hate myself for this. Bark, one, two, bark. three. One, two, three. Bark, bark, one, two, bark, three. Bark, one, two, bark, three. Bark. Also, I gotta bark, turn that bark, off right bark. now because I might get hit by a copyright thing. You've already been hit. Oh, Welcome shit. back to Metal Gear. Welcome back to Metal Gear. Dan's fucking it up already. I completely forget how to stop this music. I love that song, but also I can't listen to it right now. No, we've got to listen to, like, Snake listen to other shit. Yeah, we got a whole bunch of stuff we got to listen to. Uh, in the meantime, I'm going to see which place has more side-offs for us, because, yeah, guess what? We're doing another side-off episode where we listen to tapes. Well, we have to in order to get the game to do what it needs to do, because we're stupid and we didn't listen to the tapes throughout the entire rest of the time we played the game. I mean, I could have just listened to them off screen, but I feel like that would be depriving people of the true Dan experience. This is the oh, Dan by the way, the uh, the Fulton uh, rocket launcher finished. It's not very good, but I'm gonna bring it anyway. You said that wasn't that the thing that they promised in like DLC and then yeah, it doing? took them like seven months. And then also, was... I'm going to bring the tornado, because I'm pretty sure I set out specifically to show off the tornado last time, and I didn't actually do that. You probably forgot. I mean, you were pretty drunk. I was a little bit drunk, but anyway. But anyway, Jesus is a friend of ours, and we think that Jesus he thinks you ours. should get some help for your problems. <laughs> That's not what Mother Angelica <laughs> said. She said, suffer like the shit pig you are. <laughs> She said, "Because God hates you." <laughs> she said, "Despair is the true greatness." My mother, <coughs> mother Angelica oh God, was, was the ultimate despair. I was drinking. <laughs> you said, <laughs> "Oh my God!" God I I'm keep just imagining Mother Angelica doing all the uh, crazy poses that <laughs> does. Shit, uh, edit that out, but, like, actually, because that's Put a bleep a fairly over major it. spoilers. Um, well, actually, that game's been out for, like, what, like, ten years now, so... Yeah, but, like, you know... Um, yeah, maybe I'll say. leave that in. People are cosplaying as her and pretending to be crazy, so... But also, I think... Wait, we have Quiet, not our dog. Oh, yeah, she got better. Dog. I thought she died. Yeah. No, she got better. Or has she not died yet? Oh, no, we're we're past that mission. Oh, so she's dead. Yeah, but she got better. Cool. I keep meaning to send you the fucking opening to the an the, fir the, the first game's anime because... Wow. <laughs> and I keep Is forgetting. I'll have to... I'll have to... I'll have to remember to send it to you because wow. Actually, when you do that, I'm going to send you the opening to, uh, at the very least, uh, JoJo Season 2, because it is very good. Oh, see, now I'm not- I'm giving you something that's not so good, and you're giving me something good, so we're- Oh, oh, I- when you said wow, I thought it was going to be really good. Oh. <laughs> ah. It's, um, something. It's a thing. Oh. I see a doggy. Bark! A doggy not too happy, but Dan. Oh, no, those doggies are sneaky. Oh, I thought you killed them. I'm like, Dan, how the fuck could no, you? No, I will take them to my base. Also, I just realized it's going to flash in with that little on-air thing every once in a while. Hey, Dan, but put a tape on. A... Wow. I was I would have actually done all of these <laughs> missions without putting on a single tape. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. Why are we LPing this? Why are we LPing well, this? Why are we LPing anything? Do you know that Chip Cheesem is going to be doing a Metal Gear Solid 5 LP soon? Don't tell people that. No, what? People should absolutely watch that instead of ours when it comes out. That's why I'm trying to finish this so quick. People should watch ours first. No, they shouldn't. And they shouldn't should, watch any of our and episodes. Then cleanse their palate with a good LP of this game. <laughs> <laughs> I will say this, uh, Chip Cheesem also LP Zone of the Enders. Uh, he played it on 
uh, hard mode and also edited his videos. I played it on very hard and didn't, so I'm better than him at Zone of the Enders. Zone of the Enders you're really good at. Zone of the Enders 2 you're not. I am not. You haven't even seen me as Zone of the Enders 2. Yeah, but I've heard you bitch about it enough. It's horrific, man. It's embarrassing how bad I am at Zone of the Enders 2. He's talking about Liquid, by the way. You should pay attention to this. As you can he's tell Cam Clark. Name, he's the only light -skinned kid well, in the not yet. Not to mention the blonde hair and the blue eyes. Not common in about 20 time. years or so. We have no idea Why wouldn't they get Cam Clark back for this? Experience. any of the games? The huge black. <laughs> With the exact same voice, but as Child Liquid. <laughs> that would have been the best! I would have paid oh my money God. for that! Oh, oh that's it. <laughs> Don't be rude to quiet. <laughs> She I does her best. Like quiet. You know who's better than quiet? Is it Doug? <laughs> it's a dog. You Dogs. are 100% correct about that, but still. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Rocket punches the shit. You would do this all the time if you had an arm like this. You have no idea. Well, you'd probably send your rocket fist into the other room to get a beer for you and bring it back. Are you kidding me? I would spend, like, four hours constantly missing and still trying to do it because I want to do it more than I want a beer. Hey, buddy. Oh my god, right in the It's not so much for their sake. It's for the world that we're trying to create. No other way about it. Outer heaven. Kids are amateurs. Outer heaven. Running around where we're trying to work. Can't believe the fucking Impossible. Fire Emblem had them start a mercenary kingdom in the desert. <laughs> I was like, I excuse me. Wait, excuse I just me. Remember you sending, you sending that to me and just be like, the Dan Dan started started out of heaven. So <laughs> my friend started oh, oh, out of no. heaven. Oops. Help. <laughs> Oh, damn, 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 we fucked up. <laughs> uh, I guess apparently they still helped the king a lot, so, you know. They weren't totally out of heaven. Oh, yeah, we still have... Oh, wow, we still have a lot of these, actually. Because we did we are, good. We are nowhere close to, like, where we should be in the plot. It's a disaster, but what else can we do? We've taken away his weapons and banned him from using his... You know what I... You know what these tapes make me miss, though? Like what? Good old fashioned Metal Gear cutscenes. <laughs> right. <now>. Like. <laughs> Look at this asshole. <laughs> he is just with his face. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> this, this is awesome. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> oh my god, this is great. You know, like. I wouldn't mind. Like, Metal Gear Solid 4 is going to be so weird after this game. It is, and that is one thing that I miss, is just being able to, like, sit back and drink while riffing on the game. Uh, like, th this game actually makes me play the game. God. Yeah, Dan, it's been, been like a that. year since you've done the Metal Gear Solid drinking game, so... It has not been that... Well, I mean, also, we've been playing shit like Sonic. Sansy. Sansy O1... If we do Shad Hedgehang, we should have we should we should we should absolutely not have a drinking have game. A goddamn drinking game for that? Are you insane? Every time Shadow what? says "damn," take a shot. Does he dead. say that a lot? Every time he dies. Don't no, don't even. <laughs> Every time Shadow picks up a gun, take a sip. D don't even. Shadow's like. I like guns and cars. Does he actually say damn a lot? Because now I kind of want to do a drinking game for Shadow Henge. He says it when he dies. It's one of his death quotes. Ow. He goes, damn. All I remember is that line. He's like, this is like taking candy from a baby, which is fine by me. And it's like, yes, Shadow, we know that you're okay. Like, come on, dude. Who wouldn't take candy? Like, it's candy. I want to steal from children. That's how hardcore I am. It's not a phase, Mom. Sonic Team went through quite a phase. Yeah, it was weird. And by going, by went through, I mean has been going through a phase for the past like 
20 years. They snored a little too much. Ca oh, this is important. genetic tests. We can finally put this worry behind us. We used the PCR technique and conducted DNA fingerprinting of the copied DNA sequences. Neither is mainstream science yet, but the concepts and procedures are sound. Both tests say there is zero percent chance that the two of you are blood relatives, meaning mm. the results are negative. He's not your son, nor is he your clone. He's just another. God damn it! But but he is because we're not actually Big Boss. Exactly. That was a hint. It was twelve years ago. All right. Well, idiots. Eli's age and appearance certainly are a good fit. I admit the first time I saw him, I did a double take. But it looks like we were worried for nothing. Eli isn't your clone. But you might still have one somewhere out there. But if Eli <laughs> isn't the boss's clone, why does he seem so obsessed with him? Not to mention having one hell of an attitude for his age. I don't know. Learning the truth about himself... Subject Shut up! We're listening to tapes! What? Oh my god. Don't please, Chris. But no clone could have a totally different DNA fingerprint. And the test left no room for error. He's coming too. Roger that. Come to think of it, when we went to OKB Zero, he stuck onto a chopper and was there. Yeah. Yep. Acting strange even then. Or actually from a little bit before. You gotta extract him. Exactly when we began these tests. Maybe he's Oh my god, shut up! Without knowing what we were doing to him. And becoming mistrustful of us. He's coming too. Roger that. So what is he then? Well, if he's gonna tell us that himself, we'll need to get him to open up the door first. Maybe you should hit him with a car, Dan. Oh, oh there's a, a helicopter chasing me. Oh, that sucks. Oh. <laughs> okay. Remember, okay. That, remember that time you ran over liquid with a car and killed him? <laughs> that was <so> awesome. <laughs> and you got a game over and had to take a shot. Yeah. It was worth it. I think that's like one of our most liked episodes. <laughs> I actually think that's- I'm pretty sure, uh, there was one episode that I saw that had like 15 likes and I was like, that's the one that I was embarrassed about, so of course people like it more. Then I- then I looked at that episode of Star Fox where I did it, everything really well and it had almost no views and almost no likes and I was like, cool. Oh, don't be so petty, babe. I, li I like it when I do really good at a game and people d are upset <laughs> as a result. Our brand isn't good Let's Plays. I have no way to shoot this helicopter down. Tell Quiet to jump at it. She I gave her... <laughs> she can, like, jump oh. really high, like, do her, like, parasite shit. I mean, she can, but she won't. She's such a bitch. It's for cutscene zone only. How do we kill this helicopter, Dan? Yeah, you know, I'm kind of wondering to myself what we're about to do with this situation. Can you fault it? <laughs> Can you fault it? Fire a bolt rocket at you? Eh. Eh. Six bullets, enough to kill anything that moves, including a helicopter. Ocelot, you promised! <laughs> Well, helicopter's not alive, Dan, so you can't kill it. Oh, shit. Well, there's a person inside the helicopter. They're protected by, like, a helicopter. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, that's that's kind of the whole problem, isn't it? Pequod, shoot this thing down, please. Can you... Oh my god, I think I actually managed to shoot this thing down with a fucking tornado. <laughs> yeah, Pequod just fucked off to the landing zone. I just actually shot down this helicopter with a handgun. <laughs> you saw it. It was recorded. Everybody saw that. 
Everybody saw it. 10 out of 10. Damn, it's Nobody great. can say that didn't happen, that I did not just shoot down a goddamn helicopter with a goddamn handgun. Put another tape on. Oh, yeah. I'm the tape relief. You, you should be. It's really kind of the only reason you're here. About the pathogen spreading People keep commenting on this video. What are they saying? Uh, something about mystery, about Eli, and then they, someone said you're pretty good. Oh, cool. <laughs> wow, that actually fits really well that they said I'm pretty good when I'm using Ocelot's weapon. Can they hear us? Or no? Uh, they cannot hear us. They can only get the game's audio. Cool. They shouldn't be able to see this at all because I put it to unlisted. Yeah, they came in probably before you did it. Someone already liked it. Damn it! Oh my god. Other language strains may be present. You will know he was teaching them languages from all over the world. The Devil's House. Gonzoya Badia Bolu. Remember that? We fought Volgan there. Oh yeah, Volgan. He lived he was in this game. He was in this game. Man, how could anyone play this game without Peace Walker? <laughs> I did. How did you manage to, like, actually understand anything? I kind of didn't. <laughs> yeah, why, HQ, why don't you just talk all the time and interrupt all the subtitles? Blah, 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 parasites. Blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. He's talking about why the Wolbachia work. That's cool. Follow me. I'll take you to the medical team. And, and like of course, as as everything, freaking bitch Huey ruined Nick. everything. Well, yeah, Huey, but, but Miller's always like, I don't trust him. Oh yeah. I mean, y you know how Miller is. Any of your men who were making out in the back, you know, that too. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Vocal cord parasites are somehow a sexually transmitted disease. Yeah, well... So, no buggery until we get it all figured out. That's not gonna work. I know, we'll work fast. <laughs> Just wrap it up. <laughs> with, with our Diamond Dog brand condoms. And don't kiss. Well, you know, we'll we'll get that. We'll get it cured soon. Just fist bump. Oh yeah, Africa today. What? Are we in Africa today? 
Are we in Africa? Really the only way. Are we? Sure, it'll prevent infection, but the cost. Are you? you would does this look like Afghanistan to you? I don't know. Tactical communications the linchpin of what we do. Did all the black people <laughs> maybe tip you off? <gasps> there, are, there are brown people in Afghanistan. No, they're not. They're all Russian. Because oh. they're <laughs> occupied by the Soviets. All the brown people were killed by the Soviets. Not all brown people were killed. Uh, in the place that we went, yes. That well, was actually a tape. <laughs> oh. About how they were all... Uh, pretty much everybody but POWs are Russian. I don't listen to the tapes. <laughs> You. <laughs> What's the point of these tape episodes then? <laughs> You're the tape police. <laughs> We're corrupt. <laughs> You're the worst. You're the actual worst. I don't remember anything in the, about this game. God damn it, Chris. You know, I feel bad because I feel like this is like oops, the best gameplay in a Metal Gear game. In the worst oh, Metal Gear game, but story-wise, woof. Like it, it, it seems like it's like the worst Metal Gear game, storyline-wise. Oh, story-wise, absolutely, it's not even close. But gameplay-wise, it's it. Everything feels so good. It's so much fun. And I don't know why he did it this way. Uh, because Konami was like, get the fuck out of our company. Yeah, but even from, like, the ground up, the stuff he did put in the game that was done. Analysis complete. You know? No. Cause, like... I have no idea what you're talking about. Cause, like, there wasn't, there's not a lot of cutscenes, a lot of it's Analysis tape, a lot of it's just kind of run around and do what you want stuff. Oh, that's cause, uh, people were always complaining about the long cutscenes. I and so it was like, all right, well, I'll I'll put them all on tapes, kind of like I, sort of like I did with the uh, Peace Walker, but more so. That's true. I mean, Peace Walker had an excuse though, because it was on limited hardware. But well, yeah, that's fair. I would have taken. But Peace Walker had a story that you could follow, kind of. Ah. <laughs> It is possible someone brought eggs onto the base without Huey. stuck to their No, I think it was quiet. Oh. Well, that makes the most sense to me. Oh, quiet knows she has the English strain though, doesn't she? No, they're talking about the Key Congo strain. Oh. But his gears disinfected immediately upon return. Actually, yeah. Oh wait, no, I think it was cuz uh a big boss kept t touching everything in the devil's house. Oh yeah. Like, this, this isn't a biohazard. Let me just get wrist deep in this infected guy. He's coming too. Roger that. Any and all prisoners, soldiers, materials, and animals extracted during missions were also quarantined. So that just leaves. I have seen children around here. Oh, that's right. It was the kids. Some were being held hostage at a mine. And there were the troublemakers at Wally Yamasa. Um. Wally Yamasa. Yeah. Their clothes, their things. Did you burn them? Boop, 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 boop. We couldn't. And besides, not one of them's shown symptoms. The parasites don't infect prepubescent hosts. Their vocal cords are not fully developed. Well, if infection doesn't occur in children. It is possible they carried eggs on their clothes, and the infection yeah. spread from them. Check the kids' stuff. Burn it all. Burn the kids. Don't, don't burn the kids. Burn them down. Do not burn the kids. Throw them all off the water. The name Bwala Yamasa got quite a reaction from me. I'm guessing that's the Congo strain. <clears throat> Whoa, what a blueprint. Cool. I had them all, though. You didn't, I guess. I... 
Well, I do now, apparently. The hell? Dangerous. Uh -huh. If they failed to contain the infection, it would slip into the surrounding regions. At which point the world found out about the parasites, making them useless as a weapon. Incredible they risk such a thing. Yeah, the world didn't find out about these parasites. It was erased by the Patriots. It was. Oh, it was erased by Jesus. Jesus was a patriot. Jesus was a patriot. Little known fact, Jesus was invited to the Patriots' house. And he was, they were like, you want to join us? And Jesus was like, eh, I guess I got nothing better to do. <laughs> It was like, wait, do we really have to kidnap people and turn them into cyborgs? Like, I think we could just ask for volunteers. And you were like, you know what, Jesus, I don't think you're a good fit for our organization. And they they, they fired Jesus. It may have been the temperature, or hygiene standards, or perhaps the parasites reacted quickly to become... It's probably the hygiene standards. It's always the hygiene standards. Yeah, we don't really have... I mean, we only have temporary showers on Mother Base. We should really get some, like, permanent ones. You know, what we also probably get rid of is mice. Eh. I mean, there's only really mice on the, uh, zoo strut. You don't they know that. Stealing all of them. You don't know that. They How mice get, like, in the pipes and in the walls. How would the mice get into the middle of the ocean? Does... <laughs> The mice you brought in, they, they breed like rabbits. They get the that is actually very specifically why the zoo strut is completely separate from the rest of the base. Oh, you have to fly to get to it? Yeah, we, we went there. Oh yeah, we did go there. But, like, how do you know that the mice didn't get into, like, the helicopter at some point and you brought it back? Because he never lands. You don't know that he never lands. He just never lands in the gameplay. What? He only he only goes here with us. Well, we We've have seen to... every time he's come to Afghanistan. We have other helicopters. Africa. No, we only have the one. Peacock have... flies it all the time. We have my boy. We have outer ops and all that shit, right? No. They're <laughs> no shut up. Our they're garbage fired, soldiers. They're fired via torpedo. <laughs> Our garbage soldiers could have brought rats in. I love that Kotaku said in reality there's no one to blame right as we are discussing who did this. <laughs> and then these mice that came from the from the outside could have like danced in the kids' clothes and, sh and stuff and then brought the parasites all over Mother Base. Seagulls. Ooh, ooh, ooh. They, they're already spicy. They already know I'm here. Oh, well, they already know somebody's here anyway. Whoa, hey, quiet. How you doing? Hey, buddy. Hey, Jesus. Skapow. And Skapow. We should have put Eli's kids. We should have put the kids on a boat and sent them to like orphanages. What about the second test? Actually, that probably would have been worse. Yeah, then they'd infect everyone. Are you kidding me? We probably should have burned the children. What the fuck? <laughs> Just. No, Zero. we should not have burned the just children. Fucking, Are you kidding me? Just fucking put them all in the furnace for a while. They'll be fine. Yeah, why don't you... Uh. <laughs> Cast something real quick? Yeah. No. <laughs> That's not a question. To just, just in general, no to the things that you're saying? Let's put them like in a really hot shower for like a few days. I mean, th that's not how you fix the, the 
Vulcan Core Parasite problem. You, you need the Wolbachium, which we have readily available. You boil the parasites till they die. No, you, you just take the needle, <laughs> get the Wolbachia, and then you're safe. You don't boil. have to burn any children. <laughs> burn all or their boil shit. boil any children. <laughs> burn all their or shit. Or do anything. Burn all their shit. I don't care <laughs> if it's a precious family heirloom. Burn it. Uh, this guy's not even that good. But Boil it and disinfectant. He's coming too. Roger that. <laughs> That's how it works, right? Freeze it. Don't yeah, yeah. You just you just get a big old pot full of disinfectant. Just get that boiling. <laughs> yeah, I'll say you got a stew going, baby. <laughs> just throw all the kids' shit into it. <laughs> just a pot full of Purell. Boil it at 100 <laughs> degrees Celsius and you're golden. Put all the clothes in it, all the guns, all the... All the children, yeah. <laughs> all the children. It's like a hot tub, they'll be fine. <laughs> it's a hot tub full of Purell. <laughs> they'll be fine, just don't drink the liquid, kids. Ooh. Oh, of course it is. God damn. You don't fuck this. Miller, send me a car. I want to walk. So more females means more Wolbachia carriers, so it can keep thriving in the following generations. But the yes. in a human host are supposed to be a main path. Yeah, don't pretend you've been listening to these tapes. <laughs> I've been discussing my plans on how to take care of the parasites. On on how to boil babies. Yes, we all know how you want to boil babies. I do not want. Despite to boil the fact that this problem has been solved already, it, it wouldn't have happened if we weren't like taking in every child we found. Boss. Yeah, God, what an asshole, boss! Saving these children from being child soldiers. You stupid prick. You goddamn buffoon. <laughs> You stupid asshole. Well, like, it's not his job. He's not running fucking Big Boss's school for girls. <laughs> yeah, why would you help these stupid children? You unbelievable sack of shit, Big Boss. <laughs> you are the true problem here. He is the true problem here, I'm sorry. These these children should have died on the battlefield, like normal poor people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, we're br we're bringing the whole proletariat bourgeoisie thing into this. Hey, it's because they have parasites. Surprise, surprise. We don't need that infecting mother base. Yeah, vocal cord parasites, they only affect poor people, so we should just boil all the poor people. My name is Grace. That's my opinion. <laughs> I didn't say that. I live in the United States where poor people are boiled. They are not. Well... <laughs> You, you, look, you, you fucking idiots elected Trump. It might happen. Look, I just said that we should disinfect the children. That's how yeah, I'm... That's, with that's, boiling pots of Purell. <laughs> just put them in it. Take up the baby. Put it in the pot. <laughs> do not boil the baby. <laughs> it's fine. It's a hot tub. No, do not boil the baby. That's not how hot tubs... That's not how hot hot tubs get. You don't know that. I do. I've been in one. They're fine. Exactly one, and then I was chased out by security because I was poor. Did that happen? Uh, no, no, it didn't. Where were you? In actually, a hot don't think I've. I've actually never been in a hot tub. We could go in a hot tub at, like, the hotel, but you said you're allergic to chlorine, so I'm like, well... Oh my god, D why would they put chlorine in a hot tub? To clean the water. It's Dan a tub! Dan, pools, pools, <clears throat> pools are just literally, like, places where kids go to pee. Yeah, but, oh, the hot tub's connected to the pool? Well, it's in the same room. Oh, then, yeah, fuck that. Then I don't want to go in a hot tub. But, like, I'm looking at, like, rooms, and they have one with, like, a big jacuzzi jetted tub, and I'm like, I kind of want to do that. Oh, yeah, you almost did that, and I was like, that sounds cool, and then you were like, actually, I want to be in the city. And then it, it was amazing, and I loved it. Yeah, but I was looking in the, in the, in the hotel we normally stay in has rooms with tubs like that, except they're Wait, actually really? in, like, the bedroom. They're in, like, the bathroom instead of being, like, in the middle of the fucking room like they were at that the other hotel. 
Yeah, that that was weird. I remember when you sent me that, and I was like, that that feels strange. But also, the TV is right there, so we would still be able to watch Unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt. We have a whole third season to watch. We do, and I'm so excited for it. Also, I'm assuming that you also assume that were you to go into the hot tub, I also would join you, right? Uh, yeah, I would hope so. Uh, okay. Because <laughs> for a second there, I was like, is that presumptuous of me? No, we'd be in the hot tub. Uh, Quiet, I'm pretty sure... No, actually, I don't think I did tell her to come down here. I'm sorry, Quiet. <laughs> we don't even need bathing suits. You get a free pass on this one. Wait, what? Wait, it's, it's it's in our hotel room. Oh, you said we don't need bathing suits. I thought you said we don't have any bathing suits. Oh no, we don't need them. I was gonna be like, what are you talking about? Analysis complete. Analysis complete. Okay. Buddy has infiltrated the map. Has been updated. Buddy has infiltrated the outpost right after you pretty much did all the reconnaissance yourself. So you know whatever. You're trying real hard, quiet. Why don't we have a dog? Because you know I I, I felt like we should at least give Quiet a chance. Put her in the pot. Don't put Quiet in the pot. There's no pot. What? <laughs> Why, why are you trying to make this pot thing happen? <laughs> Coming too. Roger that. I really want a, a hot, like a hot tub. Like I really want one. It sounds really comfy. I want a bathtub that actually is like a functional bathtub. Is, are there not functional bathtubs? Well, like the bathtub that I have is like, it's way too low to like be a real comfortable bathtub. Uh, I just straight up don't have one. Because our shower's in a bathtub. Because I'm poor. It's kind of like, our shower's kind of like the one that we have in the hotel, except the bathtub is like way lower. Oh. So you can't like sit in it and get like all covered in the water. Roger. Ah. So it's just kind of cold and... Oh, shit. Sorry, Pequod. I'm actually going to extract via box. Sorry, I didn't mean to call you all the way here. Just to <laughs> fucking ding dong ditch you by helicopter. Arrived at mother base. I love that you can extract yourself on a box. Right. Through it's a wormhole. Awesome. We have been at this for nearly forty minutes. It did In not the feel 80s. like it. In the eighties. You know, we had wormholes, but the Patriots censored it. They just censored it straight on through Metal Gear Solid 4, because the wormholes never came back again. Well, they will in Metal Gear Survive, which I still have high hopes for. Shut up. But Metal Gear Solid Survive, isn't that going to take place in, like, the 80s too, but in an alternate dimension? Yes, exactly. And Bonnie Tyler will be a special character who joins Diamond Dogs to save us from the Zambos. Is By that, the way, like, uh, a real thing? Whoa, whoa, what, what are you doing? Is Quiet. she, like, is that, like, a real thing? What? No, obviously not. Are you kidding me? I was getting excited. I'm like, you know what? Maybe I could play that game with Bonnie Tyler. What is Quiet doing? Why is she doing that? I mean, you already said you were going to play it with me. Yeah, if I, I, I gotta. As, wow. Yeah, don't try to sound too interested in the game. People might think that this might actually be a fun LP. Why is Quiet? Why was Quiet doing that? I don't know. She's she wanted to go in for the home run, but I don't know. Grand slam, thank you, ma'am. Uh, I don't know what that means. Next time on Metal Gear Solid Five, the Phantom Pain. We're gonna bring his dog. Yes, what everyone's Yay, actually dog. here for, Doggo. Yes, dog slay. Was did, was that right? 